The days are getting shorter and it will eventually feel cooler outside. Yeah, and humans aren't the only ones sensing the impact of that. Some of the nation's most beautiful insects are as well. WCNC Charlotte meteorologist KJ Jacobs explains. Catching a glimpse of the iconic monarch butterfly fluttering around is not by coincidence. The monarch migration occurs every year between August and October as they travel from Canada to Mexico. City of Charlotte arborist Lori Reed says the monarchs that make it to Mexico are the great-great-grandchildren of the ones that started in Mexico. They don't lay eggs along the way. They are just fueled and driven just to get down to Mexico to spend the winter. And then in the spring, usually like March, April, May-ish is when they're going to come back. Now, the ones that spend the winter in Mexico, they'll come up north and lay eggs along the way, but they're not going to make it all the way back to Canada, right? So they'll lay eggs, their babies will grow, change into butterflies, and continue to go north throughout the summer. And changing seasons can't have an impact. Reed says Mexico provides a good microclimate for overwintering with temperatures between 32 and 59 degrees. It's cool to help them conserve you know, their body fat. So if they're going somewhere that's like super duper hot, they're going to be using a lot of their energy reserves, but they're going somewhere that's a little bit cooler. Um, those fur forests, they're higher up in elevation. They've got good fog, so they've got good moisture. So that area is just perfect for them to be able to stay the winter. Reed says we can all have a positive impact on these butterflies. Even just planting a couple milkweed plants and a couple plants that have nectar provided for those adults, it really does help. You don't have to have acres and acres of property to be able to help the monarchs. When it comes to navigation, it is believed these butterflies use the position of the sun and the magnetic pull of the earth, among other factors, for direction. From the Weather Deck, a meteorologist, KJ Jacobs, WCNC Charlotte.